There's a snap to Jeremy Liggins trying to work off the right side. Liggins fighting toward the goal line, and he's in there. Touchdown, Ole Miss. Jeremy Liggins with his first TD as an Ole Miss Rebel. I grew up like two, three miles away from the stadium. and uh, like I can go on my front porch and I can hear the announcer over the PA. I can hear the crowd when he's roaring and everything. I was visiting with Jeremy this morning. I told him that when his playing days are over, he could be the mayor of Oxford, you know? Yeah, people around here, they really love him. Anywhere I go, they ask me about Jeremy Liggins. And, you know, it's just, it's just a great thing to see that, you know, the, the town and city of Oxford is, is counting on Jeremy to make something happen for itself. And the Rebels are going for it on fourth and inches as your shotgun quarterback is Liggins. He takes the snap, he fakes the handoff, keeps and runs off the left side and powers to the 40-yard line. First down, Ole Miss. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got to keep working on that. Did you feel that? Yeah, you felt that? We got to keep working on that. Hey, when you back in your, in your apartment, just do that every now and then. You got me? Do that. Like a little dance or something. You got me? You can dance a little bit, huh? Yeah, I got a little room. I got you. Okay, let's go. Coming out here today trying to give more energy than we take. I want to be givers, not takers. Even when we first started, we, we told them, look, we may end up moving you to another position depending on what's going to help be best for our football team. He said, Coach, all I want to do is help this team. Uh, so you look at, he's, he's played quarterback, he's played tight end, and he's played left tackle in the spring. Um, and, and he really could play just about anything, to be honest with you. So now to help the team, man, whatever I got to do to help the team win because I know that's a bigger outlook if the team win and if I go out and score two or three touchdowns and we lose. While it's clear Jeremy Liggins' easygoing nature has made him well-liked within the Rebel locker room, his path to where he is today wasn't always so clear. When I was like three years old, they found blood in my urine. and uh, So we went to the doctor and... Uh, my doctor was Dr. Sanford here in Oxford, and he actually referred me to St. Jude when I was three. And uh, once we got there and went through the whole process of getting into St. Jude, they diagnosed me with uh, a Williams tumor. It was in my left kidney. I just had to start our way back over, man, but um, thank God for St. Jude. That's the reason I'm here right now. In and out of the hospital at a young age, Liggins would need to have his left kidney removed in order to save his life. Jeremy, he, he's the right type of person. He, if he has a, anything wrong with him, you're never going to know. Uh, he's just going to go about his business uh, every day. Jeremy's always played with one kidney. That 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 uh, probably was a bigger concern to me uh, in the beginning than it is now. Uh, you know, I, I I know he had to overcome that. He's overcome a lot of things like that. He had it. Beat For real? Mm. He didn't. No. Really? What? Yeah. The only reason I found out when he came over to tight end and he still had the real protection on, I said, man, what's going on? He said, Coach, I only have one kidney. I said, oh, okay. You know, but he doesn't make excuses. You know, he makes, he makes things happen. A lot of guys always try to give me, you know, jokes and he and ha ha's about it, you know, because I used to be a quarterback. And they always be like, you know, take that quarterback jacket off. You ain't a quarterback no more. But um, I guess a lot of people just didn't understand the reason that I was wearing it. And once I explained to them what happened, a lot of people understood through his hardships or difficulties. Um, he certainly has overcome them with the right type of attitude to, to put others first and to, to be a giver and, and not a taker. I think I'm just like any regular person out here. I just got one kid and that's it. So um, it really don't bother me at all. And Carlton Martin's in there with Nick Parker, Jeremy Liggins, the jumbo sets. The Rebels are going to try to wedge it in there. Jeremy takes the snap. He goes straight ahead over the top. He breaks the plane. Touchdown, Ole Miss. You know, what a weapon. When you get in close quarters and you can slam a 300-pounder in there that's an athlete, I mean, that's just how versatile this guy really is. Go, baby. Hey, Lee! Lee, you got that thing in me, boy. Oh. It does take a guy that has to come in and study, a guy that has to, um, you know, be willing to be coached. To be the best, you know, you got to want to be the best, man. And that's kind of what I did every day. I just try to be the best I can and set my goals high and uh, get better every day.